Bro, ain't no way they got books that's called gay BCs for kids. <laughs> hey, man, hit that like button, subscribe, turn on post notifications, follow your boy on IG. What is you doing? Follow your boy on IG, man. Also, in the link description box below, also in the comment section, the very first pinned comment is my podcast channel. I still haven't decided if I was going to put the podcast on this channel, blah, blah, blah. But anyway, that's, that's the point. All right, if you want to go subscribe and support to that channel, go ahead, man. It's lit over there, I promise you. Now, look, let's talk about the situation, okay? I'm not going to make this video too long. I'm not going to just ramble on, ramble on. But I just want to say this. All right, so they've got a book out called The Gay Season. We're going to watch it real quick. We're going to watch this video. Uh, shout out to this page. What is it? Shots by... Angel Lee. Yeah, shout out to uh, shout out to this person. You feel me? So we finna go ahead and watch this video real quick. Uh, let's see what it's talking about. Bro, they getting out of hand, bro. I'm just trying to buy my baby some books, bro. Look at this shit. A is for Alley. B is for buy. C is for, C is for coming out. D is for drag. Look these are these children books, guys. These are children books. ML <sighs> Web. You're disrespectful, bro. My kids is just trying to learn. Okay. They're just trying to learn. Why are you writing books like this? Can't they just be kids and learn a regular ABCs? What is going on? Hey Amen, my brother. For family, though. What is going Equality. Like, we got a lot. Gay. gay. Like, G is for gay. Like, we got a lot going on. <laughs> no Non-binary. No. Oh, what the Listen, is this is picture books. Oh, this is picture oh. books. My four-year-old don't know what the fuck non-binary is. First of all, look, I didn't even watch the full video, okay? I seen the gay BCs. That's the, that's the part I seen. I seen the coming out, not, but I didn't see the whole nine beer. Oh, jeez. They don't know what lesbian is. Why are you writing this, ML Web? You're disrespectful. Read this shit to your own kids. Orientation. Bro, they getting out of hand, bro. I'm just trying Bro, hold on. I gotta fix. I gotta find. I gotta see how this dude look. Okay, I, I just gotta see how this dude look. NL... NL Web. I, I just gotta see how he look. Uh, of course, they show Major League Babes. Look, I'm gonna say this. All right, I'm gonna say this. Okay, with the whole GBC book, is it disrespectful? Yes, it is. But at the end of the day, I feel like at this point, it's just normalized. All right, being gay is normalized. It's like you can come out gay, ain't nobody gonna talk about you. It's literally a normalized thing. Like they, society done made being gay normalized. So now they teaching it to kids, but you got to think about it yourself. How, how often is your kids seeing a woman and a woman kissing? How often is your kids seeing a man and a man hold hands, walking down the street, cuddle up? I mean, like you don't really see that from straight guys, you know? So it's like, how often is your kids seeing this stuff? And then parents, y'all got to watch what y'all kids is watching. You feel me? We, we give all our kids this television and all this and that. And remind you, I'm 19. And how I know this because I have a baby sister that be watching this stuff and I just be hearing the stuff that they be talking about on YouTube, on kids' YouTube, all right? Kids' YouTube, Roblox, Minecraft, bro, all that stuff has been changed from when I was a kid. Minecraft was the thing. It wasn't no gay. It wasn't none of this. It wasn't, you feel me? And it wasn't none of that, you know? So you got to be careful for what your kids is watching. But honestly, bro, the whole GBC book is way too far. It's like kids just trying to be kids, kids trying to learn, bro. When I was in school, kindergarten, we didn't have no GBC book. You know what I'm saying? They wasn't teaching kids how to be gay. They wasn't teaching kids how to be homosexual. Like, they wasn't teaching kids how to be none of that. And it's sad because we teaching, we teaching the young, we teaching the next generation how to grow without God in their life. You feel me? That, that, that's just sad to me. The fact that we got to teach, we teaching the younger generation. We're not teaching it, but society, government, like everybody's just teaching, teaching it. How to, like, we teaching kids how to grow separately from God. It, it's so many different things kids can learn about, but we teaching them about gay stuff. You know what I'm saying? When they grow older and they figure out that this is what they want. Fine, but we're not going to shove it down their throat. Just how I don't shove my Christianity down people's throats, I might spread the word to I might plant the seed in you and, and just hope and pray that that seed grows in you. But at the end of the day, I'm not going to shove it down your throat and force you to become what I am. You know what I'm saying? I feel like that's what society is doing, forcing kids to become what they want them to become. Be happy with who you are. Be ha No. Yes, be happy with who you are. Yes, that is totally true. But I feel like it's better to be happy with who you are when you're with God. I feel like that's just better for me. I just that's just me. Y'all let me know what y'all think in the comment section below. And then another thing, another thing is um when it comes when it comes to all this homosexual and all this and that, like I said before, I don't have a problem with gay people. Live your be if you this that, if that's what you want, that's what you want. You know what I'm saying? 
I'm going to spread the word to you. I'm going to still talk to you about God and just pray that you change your life around. But if that's what you want, that's what you want. I'm not going to I'm not going to be that person. Oh, I'm homophobic. I hate gay people. Like, I'm not that person. You know what I'm saying? That's just not me. I love each and everybody for who they are and what they do with their life. I love you for what you do. Whatever you do, I love you for it. I mean, I don't support just because I don't support it. Don't mean I don't love it. I mean, love you. <laughs> that didn't make sense at all. I don't support it, but I still love you as a person. You feel me? That's just that's just the whole thing. Like, bro, we gotta be better. We gotta really be better, bro. We shouldn't be teaching kids about being gay and this and that. Like, bro, like he said, allow kids to be kids, bro. You know what I'm saying? Because you only can be a kid one time. And I'm gonna tell you like this. I wish I was still a, like y'all might look at me as a kid, but I am a young adult. You know what I'm saying? I pay bills now, so it's like. Me being a kid, or the way I look at being a kid is when I didn't have pay bills, and I could just come home, play the game, didn't have a job. You know, I, I, I got to work now. I got to work and provide for myself. So I wish I had the opportunity to be a kid again. I do. I wish I took advantage of that. I really do. I wish I wasn't focused on women. I would have been. I would have been focused on this YouTube. I would have been focused on all that, but that's besides the point. Y'all let me know what y'all think in the comment section below about this whole gay BC thing. Like, it's, it's crazy to me. Then the rainbow and all that, bro. Like, come on, man. Society done changed the, changed the real meaning behind the rainbow. They done made the rainbow seem gay. You know what I'm saying? The rainbow is to specify God's promises, and yet... People switch that society, switch that rainbow, and now every time you see a dude with a rainbow on his shirt, it, it, we automatically think, oh, that's gay. And now they're teaching little kids that the rainbow means gay. <laughs> it's ridiculous, bro. Uh, but y'all let me know what y'all think in the comment section below. Hit that like button, subscribe, turn on post notifications, follow your boy on IG, do what you do. Don't leave me. That rhymes. I don't know why I said that, but hey, man, I love y'all. God bless. Stay blessed. Peace.